Hey guys, it's Erica. Sorry I don't have my usual setup or anything, but I was outside and I found these snake plants. I, I promise you I did not dig them up from someone's front yard. I just found them. Uh, they were kind of uprooted. I think that someone was counting them as weeds or something. But um, I just wanted to see if I could save them. Just to see. So let me uh, show you here. Hold on. Okay, so here are the plants. Here are their roots. And I don't know if they're going to survive because these leaves, well this one's okay, but this one especially, like, snake plants should not be able to bend like this. It feels like leather. So I'm going to see what I can do for it. They probably need water, so the first thing I'm going to do is um, put them in soil and then water them. Okay, this is the quickest soil that I have available. Um, cactus mix and a bunch of perlite, my favorite combo. And I'm just gonna get ready to pot these. Sorry guys, but this is as good as it's gonna get. Here we go. Just gonna put this in here. Again, I'm sorry about the quality of this video. Uh, I just didn't want to wait until the morning to film this. I was thinking about just cutting the leaves, but they're, I think they're way too unhealthy to grow roots on their own. So I'm just going to see how they'll do like this. Okay, perfect. Here is the plant, and now I'm going to water it. And I'm just using regular hose water. I know that Sansevieria's are common, and I don't really need to be like trying to save one, but I just want to see how hardy they really are. It's just doing so bad. I'm just gonna leave it in a kind of shady area, and in the morning, I will give you an update on how it looks. It'll probably look the same, but oh, maybe you can see the leaves better here. They're just really bad. Hey guys, it's Erica, and right here I have my snake plant that I found outside, left to die, and I just wanted to give you an update on how it looks like it's doing. Not good. Let me just say, it does not look like it's doing good. Um, so, as you can see, it's very floppy still. I'm probably going to end up cutting this leaf because, look, a snake plant really should not be able to do that. Oh my gosh, I have a snake plant, a healthy snake plant, right here. I can show you how it's supposed to look. Let's just do a comparison here. So, this snake plant is thriving, looks beautiful, has some baby leaves sprouting out. This one is flopping everywhere and it's ripped in half right here. <laughs> and it looks like it's like a really tan old lady. So some of this plant looks like it's doing fine. Like this, this leaf actually looks like it's doing pretty good other than the fact that this, this part has been torn off of it. And then this one is okay. So the pot that it's in is the soil is still kind of wet, which that's not good. Oh, okay. The soil looked a lot wetter than I thought it was wet, but it's just kind of damp. Yeah, it's pretty good. The soil it's in, I think, is good. So what I'm gonna do right now is just cut off this leaf because. I don't know. Should I cut it off? I don't know if I should um, let it wait longer. It, let me tell you my thought process actually. So I kind of want to cut it because I don't want the plant to give all its energy to this top part because the bottom, the bottom part right here, the stalk feels pretty good. So that part could, if I cut it off, potentially grow babies 
and focused more on maybe root development than trying to save this leaf. And that's pretty much my thought process for that leaf and this one here. It just looks so ugly. I'm so I don't mean to call a plant looking ugly, but oh my gosh, you know what? If I don't cut it off, then I can totally cut it off later if someone in the comments is like, girl, you need to cut that off. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just not gonna cut it off and if you guys comment down below and tell me to cut it off, I will. I will perhaps do an update on how this plant is doing if it completely dies, which I don't think it will completely die. I have faith in this snake plant because it's supposed to be hardy. It's supposed to be tough as nails. <laughs> so I have faith that this plant will live but how much of it will live, I don't know. That's it for today's video. It's kind of a random one, you know, trying to save a plant, but I was gonna do it anyway, so why not film it? But yeah, so please let me know what you think down below and subscribe to my channel because I post a new video every single day. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day or night and I'll see you next time. Bye.